If you have a feeling inside of you, think, where does that feeling come from? Does it come from pain, trauma? Do you enjoy that feeling or is it disturbing you? If it's a disturbing feeling, it likely comes from a memory that's not so good, not so good for you or the physical aspect of your body, the physical cells in your body. Why does trauma affect the body? Well, it creates a tension, an unconscious tension that contracts your cells. And when your cells are contracted, of course, they're not uh, functioning as well. They're not detoxifying as well. They're not metabolis metabolizing energy as well. And even they, the way they reproduce will be compensated. So they won't reproduce into healthier cells. And that's how disease manifests, right, from emotional conditions, is you have an emotional experience that causes your body to compensate, to go into a contracted, stressed state. And then all your cells, because your whole body is one, all your cells then mimic your stress state and they try and recreate themselves or reproduce themselves to, um, to mimic the entire state of your body. So every cell that you create post-trauma will be compensated and that will cause chronic sickness until you, re you release the emotions, yeah? until you feel free again, relaxed again and take a deep breath and really heal your mind before focusing only on your body. So things like homeopathy, trauma, psychotherapy, emotional freedom technique, EMDR, all these things can heal the mind and put you into a more relaxed state and so that your body can feel free again to breathe healthily again. And then all your cells will reproduce in a healthier way so you get less chronic disease. So. If you'd like to find out more on how to heal your emotions, please join me on my online course where I have special exercises to release trauma from your past so that you, your mind, and your cells can be healthy again. Thank you very much. See you soon.